well to our telecast, and in some way we trust that it will be an inspiration to you. Looking at the UFO phenomena in the light of God's Word or in the perspective of God's Word, the Bible. The UFO subject is a fascinating subject because I believe it relates to the time in which we live. I believe the Bible has and gives the answer or the solution to the UFO phenomena. Now that does not mean that I am not interested in a scientific point of view. I believe that the UFO phenomena needs to be looked at in a scientific perspective as well as from a religious perspective. The late J. Allen Hynek had made the statement that one, the one more looks into the UFO phenomena, the one more realizes that it has a religious significance to it. So I believe that J. that uh, Hynek had an insight into his research of the UFO subject. I believe that he began to realize that it's going to take more than a scientific perspective to come to a solution or a conclusion as to what UFOs are all about. I personally believe that the UFOs are appearing in the heavens above as Bible prophecy to be fulfilled. And it is indeed fulfilling Bible prophecy. It is a reference to the signs of the times in which we are living. I believe we are, close, we are living in the closing hours. I believe that Jesus Christ will return to planet Earth. Now, I am not making the statement that Christ is coming to planet Earth in a UFO. In no way I may, am I making such a statement as that. However, I believe that he is coming soon. And I believe as we read the Bible and study God's Word that we need, to, we need to know what God has to say about the return of Christ and what is going to take place upon planet Earth. Um, one way to make sure that you are prepared and ready to meet Jesus Christ is to blow off the dust of that Bible which you have on your shelf and open it up and begin to read about God's plan for a man. All right, I see we have a call, and we will take that call. Hello, and you're on the air. Okay, I'd like to know, is there anywhere in the Bible where they really come out and say that there is such a thing as UFOs? Um, there is no direct passage in the Bible that specifically says that there are UFOs. However, uh, in uh, the book of Luke, I believe it is, in chapter 21, and I often quote that scripture, where Jesus had said, And fearful sights and great signs shall there be from heaven. Now, I believe these fearful sights and great signs that are in the heavens uh, could very well be the UFO phenomena. Thank you. You're so welcome. Thank you for your call.